Sean, the only thing that the youths living over there would do for me and for you is to wake up and let that country be divided. Let them save life. We are tired of this shit. We are tired. We are tired of economy dying. We are tired of common man on the street cannot be able to afford three square meal at the end of the day. And they are not doing anything about it. I remember something somebody, one of my friends that living in UK posted in my page. And he said, the person that built Lagos have destroyed Nigeria. Where are we heading our, where are we going? And when you keep preaching that gospel, they are still sleeping. They are still sleeping. I pray that a day will come. I remember what uh, Amechi said. Amechi said, he's a thief too, but I quote his word. Amechi said, one day they will wake up and they will, they will throw stone at us. And we will stay and receive that stone. The time is coming. Also tell them, Don't back said, up. He said, oh, everybody who is still doing protests, carrying phone. Those are not the poor Nigerians. He said, when the poor people turn on them, eh, they will stone them. He also said that too. They will stone them. Definitely, sir. Definitely agree with you. Definitely. Keep on your good work, sir. Thank you, John. May Almighty God bless you. And you Let too. me give chance to other people to chip Thank in. You Thank you. Much. And God bless you. You have a wonderful uh, uh, day and night too, okay? Thanks a lot. Now, that's uh, John there. I do have another caller. Sure enough, we might actually get enough people on the call tonight as my callers are trying to cut it short and short and short. Interesting. Yeah. Hello. Hello. Hello, sir. Hello, my OG. Baba. How are you doing, Baba? Brother, me. Mm -hmm. I'm very fine, my brother. Um, my, my name is... Uh, Daniel Sukuda Alo Ezeke. Sadi, Daniel. So, yeah, yeah Sukuda Alo Ezeke. I've been following you for a very long time on uh, YouTube. Thank you very much. So, today, yeah, I had the opportunity to call. I live in China quite all right. I see. You so, know? you could get this in China. I thought China is so, uh, uh, what do, what's that called? Like uh, censored, eh? Where they say something. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, yeah, but well, you know, uh, as as we they do me, now, you did it, all right, but uh, just said it yes. That's enough. I have heard it. How you have got around me? All right. If I could have people, all right, go extra miles, right, in places where they could not yeah, 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 yeah. me, just to see me. I want you to know that I do. Of course. I do hold that in. Of course. Esteem. Thank you. Eh? Hey. That's so, brother. I don't, I don't follow you even right from when uh, Nam the Kano is still on air. Because uh, I know that whenever I see the truth, I sense it. You know, that this thing, this person is doing, this one, not the truth. My brother, you're on the right path. Thank you. And uh, as you are on the right path, China, whatever, and their sensor is restricting us a lot from doing some other thing. Yeah. If they are restricting us of, of a lot of things to do some other things other people do. You understand, but at least there is still a way we can still it do. It can only be law. Uh, it's going mean, to go that far. Yeah. You like yourself. I mean, oh, you know of I mean? course, it's six. It's <laughs> six ten a.m. Yeah, it's six ten a.m. I've not yeah. even sleep for the day. Yeah, six ten a.m. So I you know decided this is, time this is to somebody from China, like on the phone. Oh, really? Honestly, I don't wow, know. brother. I'm, I'm so opportune. I'm so I've spoken to people from uh, you know, kind of like. Most of these Asian parts as well, yeah. Asian yeah. countries, but yeah. never from China. And I was it's my first time calling in China, Baba. Honestly, 
Yeah, it's my first time calling you, and I was I'm so grateful that my first time I got attended to, I got you. See, thank you. Go on. Of course, uh, oh, of you. course. You see, I have somebody who calls me from yeah. Russia, and that too was my reaction. Okay. I was like, oh, Russia. It was actually a Yoruba brother, and every time he managed to get through, I'm like, oh, Russia. Oh no, this is yeah. good. But, see, oh, of course, of course. What, sir, what you are doing, we re we really appreciate you. you. We really, I'm I'm a number one fan. I would say of you here in China. Okay, because I followed Nam the Kano for a very long time, and I realized that this man is telling the truth. And since he is no longer on air, you are now the next person. I have realized that you also you are telling it the way it is. You understand? So many of us, my ego, if I tell you my story of being a Nigerian since I was born in 1982 till now, you know how old I am. I can't tell you. know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes, you know, brother. So, Nigeria, you know, tell yeah. Me which of them you would like to, 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 you know, to, you like to share with us, if you don't mind. Oh. You know, uh, I don't even, uh, there, I miss countless of all your preachings and everything you have said online. But uh, I just want to make emphasis as calling in, as I just called in for the first time today. So I just want to make emphasis on that belief, your preaching that anybody that still believes that Nigeria has something to offer, that person is on the wrong, is on the wrong side of life. Yeah, they are on the wrong side of life. Kidnapping in my uh, kidnapping in Nigeria, my I was one of the first people that was kidnapped in Enugu State in the year 2019. Wow. I came back. Yes, I came back from Malaysia to prepare for my documents to go to China, and I was kidnapped in Enugu together with my friend. Yeah. In Enugu State, so I'm African, together with my friend, like you were kidnapped, all right. And yes, this was yes. In Enugu, like you said. Of and course, was, oh, yes. Sorry. I'll let you finish, please. Tell us whichever one you you have enough you know, to share with us. I'm sure you get. But yeah. I'm not here. So of course, of mm -hmm. course. Yeah. So this kidnapping was not done by anyone else. It was done by the full and militia. They told us this point black that if you like bring in the police in this local government, if you like bring in the army, we must be kidnapping people. And we paid a ransom of five million in 2019. You understand what I'm telling you? So now I am in China. I still got my family in Nigeria. You know? You have them there, your loved ones, and, and, uh, that, and nobody wants to wake up tomorrow morning with the news that tell oh, they don't kidnap Papa. I say, Oh my god, of course, and I'm a father, so <laughs> this kind of a uh, massive kidnapping and all this, you know, uh, so that uh, they go to school, they of course they kidnap 300 children, they kidnap this and they kidnap that. My who is eating a lot inside of me because. This, yeah, this is Nigeria. You still got children there. You still yes, got I kids do. there, I'm family there. there. I should be worried yeah. every now and then. Do you know my own worry uh, is uh, even beyond just Fulani terrorists now, all right? Yeah. Because I have figured out that there are actually level, you know, where you have poverty, where poverty increases, okay, or prevalent, like exists like we have in Nigeria right now. There's possibility. For, yeah. I mean, sorry, it's not even possible. There's uh, going to be increase in crime, and there are some petty petty of crimes, course. right? That could go. Yeah. Wrong. People say they're offsprings. You get what I mean now? Like there are some petty petty crimes yeah. that could really go wrong, all because somebody needs more money. They could bring. A, of course. I mean, they could bring a whole tragedy to the entire family for small peanut. That's of course. You ask yourself that they ask me, I will give them the money. Or why did they do this to me? Why this or that? I fear that and I dread that every day. And that's why I keep saying of that course. we are all waiting victims. It's not because we are not, I mean, we are not. Yeah. There. Eh? We have people that are so and, uh, to our if, if anything happens to them, of course. we will be broken. 
And most of these people that are so dear to our heart has yeah. made themselves comfortable inside that place to an extent that even if you are trying to let them know what is wrong with the system, they will tell you that we just have to pray. My, this is the truth. The Even somebody you send, yeah, somebody that called you on the phone today and tell you, I cannot feed my children. I don't even have 1,000 with me. Can you please do something? Somebody you send money right now, you will tell that person that this place I'm sending money to you, this place, this, this place is now casted. There is nothing you can do about it for this place to remain one. And that person will tell you that we just have to pray. Why are we going to pray? We are praying without a Oh my God. Did I just. Uh... Oh, are you still there? I've gone. Oh my God. Churches, I of course, I'm still here. Go on, sorry. No, no, no. I'm still here, yeah. So I've gone to so many places in Nigeria. I've seen things. I've grown a business in Nigeria, and that business, I lost it in Nigeria. I've grown another, and I'll still do what? I lost it because of one policy or the other. Okay, right now, during the regime of uh, Boko Hari, mm -hmm. you understand? Yep. Of course, during the regime of Boko Hari, there are some people that possess in their business. As an Igbo man that I am, we are more into business than everything. Yeah, there are some people that owns, yeah, what you want in your business is $10,000. Then, during the time of Boko Hari, and one policy or the other comes right now, that person that wants $10,000 today don't even want $5,000 anymore. Oh, they will be lucky to want $5,000. You are right. Except, so yeah, you won't. Because, yes, survive well, that period because they had people that actually bailed them out. Of course. There are many of us in this of course. that build our brothers, our friends, our other people to save their businesses during that time of a book, like you said, eh? But many, many people that of didn't have anywhere. Since those who even those who even enter the uh, debt looking for money to run their business, yeah. the debt to the actual capital, oh, they lost everything. So anybody yeah. who didn't have somebody somewhere who was giving them of you know channeling some money to support their businesses. I don't think somebody with $10,000 back then is legitimately owning about 5000 today from the same business. I don't think of, so. Co of course. Of course. It okay, just take for example right destroyed now. Destroyed everybody. Yeah. You know, say just, $1 million, of course, $1 million just dollars, take sorry, $1 million, uh, $1 million era, Baba, used to give us about $5,000. Of course. Maybe so. When we yes. used to, when, At when, the same rate of one six, the businessman, so at, you know, or one, one Baba, yeah. Hmm. Of course, of course. During the time of good luck, Jonathan, that is good luck, Jonathan, that is the worst, that they, they tag him the worst president that Nigeria has ever produced. You understand? Everybody came out, uh, this man must go, this man must go. But during the time of that man, there are Nigerians that survive more, more than the Iron Man that came in, you know? When they tell you that somebody is weak, I think the next thing, of course, when they tell you that they project a man to be weak, he's a weakling. I think what the people go to next is a strong man, is it not? Uh -huh. And now, yeah, in 2015, we all went for a strong man because I will say we all, though I told people then that this man is coming here to do nothing, but I will say we all because we all bear that same flag. You understand? So we tell them that this man, yeah, he's not coming in to do anything. The man you call a weekly may end up being better than this man. And at the end of the day, yeah. it becomes the truth. And now, people of are course. looking for Iron Man. I mean, they, like you said, a strong man, strong man, strong man. Strong man, strong man, don't turn to Iron yeah. Man now. People say, people, a lot of, of people longer don't bend them. Shige has bent some. Now, Shinge back. Yeah. The, is back. The, the Iron Man they crave for, the yeah. Iron Man they crave for, that is coming to save them, now become what? Don't the iron bender that bend everybody. And of course. Shige don't bend and everybody. now, Shige again. Everybody to another shape. People are now walking. They say, why, why are you walking like this? They say, I know. I'm just, you know, it's, it's the way I work. No, that's not how you walk. That's what Nigeria told you to. Iron man, iron man. Of course. Here we are. 
you know, uh, before, during the time, there was, I think, uh, I would say 10 years ago, if you ask people from the Eastern Nigeria, they will tell you that food are being sold cheap, that everything, things are cheap in the Northern Nigeria hmm. and uh, the Western Nigeria. So it's just like maybe this thing they are doing, they are just trying to suffocate only one particular people from that country, which is the people where I come from. You know, most of we, the Igbos, we always think that what is happening in Nigeria is all about only we. No, mm -hmm. it's for everybody. It is not. These people don't true. care. They don't give. Yeah. Yes. You know, they believe that. Uh, how can things, you know, when they sell petrol, for example, now, in other part of Nigeria, for example, even northern Nigeria that they have to move yeah. petrol to, to go and give, the way they complain yeah. them that they feed the rest of Nigeria. They never talk about how they have to supply them uh, the petrol they use from the southern part of Nigeria too. Anyway, the of course. That, yeah, the people, uh, what was it? What was uh, uh, that again? Yeah. So people believe that things are cheaper in the north. However, if they are selling, of the, petrol, if they are selling the petrol for uh, 170 naira in the west, the moment you yeah. need to go up north, it will go straight to let's say maybe one one eighty. But when you go to of course, the east, yeah. that is not far from where the crude yeah. oil is coming from, you begin to see prices yeah. peak one ninety, two hundred and ten, two hundred and seventeen, yes, two hundred and fifteen. And you be like, is that not the same petrol I bought in Shagamu? Now I am in uh, Delta State. See, going to the east, too, I know they sell them for two hundred and five naira. So you are right. A lot of people believe oh, that okay. this whole thing was economically organized against the Yes. Yeah. But that is not true. Uh, yes. They have different but, ways of yeah, but, everybody. Yeah, go on. When you, when you really understand the system so well, mm -hmm. you will see that these men, you know, they it's just like the Nigerian leaders right now, they are all out of, uh, what will I, how do I put it? They are all out of idea. All options exactly. The idea, the yeah, ideas of the kind of format. And, and let me let me use format. And now they are just shooting. Yeah, they are, they are out of format. Now. Hoping that it's going to hit something. Yeah. Yeah. Finally, of we course. got one. We got one. That's what they are doing right now. Yeah, it's just Slice. like yeah, it's just like a Yahoo boy, mm -hmm. you know, trying to get a client to pay. Yeah, you understand? You continue to bomb and bomb yes. and bomb uh, thousands and thousands yes. of emails. Yeah. yeah. Just the same format. Yeah. The, the same format you use on this client that gave you $1,000 is the same format you want to use on this person. The same format you want to use on this person. These guys keep on using it. Yes. And they don't even realize, the foolish one don't even realize that this person you are calling a fool today we end up being somebody that is no longer a fool but other than you you are you have now become the fool smart but see that yes is, thank you so much okay it's such a pleasure right thank speaking, you, sir. Uh, you know speaking to someone thank you, sir. Far away. how many hours from yet all today? right since i've called today since i've called today and i get you i think i will become a regular caller right now because there are more people yes, yes. possibly sees this too i want to hear from everybody you know I'm so grateful. Of course, I share. I I share your. I share a lot to people here. The groups, the whole forum, wherever we belong. I share a lot of your messages so that a lot of people will do what we key in and follow you because uh, what you are doing, my brother, you are on the right path. And uh, history will talk about you. Amen to that. Keep Thank it you up so much, and it will Keep talk it about every one of us because we won't talk about this platform without without talking about the brethren. You. So I appreciate that. My people, my people. Keep it easy. He said... God bless you. He said... So to everybody as well, my if you are still watching, people. remember, if you have already paid your offering, your offering is you like in the broadcast and it doesn't really cost you much. Hello there. Hello. Hello, sir. You might need to mute the broadcast though, so that me and you can talk. Bye -bye. My good general. Yes, sir. <laughs> I am laughing because uh, okay, it's, it's it, God will bless you and bless you and bless you. Amen. And you too, sir. Thank you. Uh, my wife have always encouraged me to call. I will say I will not get through. So why bother? I have been following you for many. I even have the my your my nickname is Mayego General. God bless you. You see, um, so I am. So, uh, 
I have my own people, and I know it. Uh, every time yeah. they get to talk. Okay. Uh, uh, my name, my name is Godwin. I'm calling from Slough in in uh, close to London. Slough. Slough. Yes. That's some. Um, very, see, that's some very unique combination there. If I'm like, uh, oh, I'm gonna go see Sir Godwin in uh, Slough. <laughs> And it, that way, right? Any time, different entirely. Mayugu, I just want to I, the, uh, praising you is just a waste of time because the whole world know that God will bless you for what you are Amen. doing. Amen. Thank you. So, and I want to just seize the opportunity. I just said, let me try. It's my wife who just said, try. You may not know. You need to listen to her more. <laughs> I promise you, if she says Fine. something all right, you need to listen to her more. Uh, yes, I will. I will. I will do. For, I will do from today. Do, just, okay. <laughs> just briefly. I did not prepare for a lot to just say because I was not preparing to call. But oh. what I just want to say, if anybody in Nigeria today tell you that he doesn't know what the problem of Nigeria is, that he doesn't know that Nigeria is not a nation, that he doesn't know that what people are doing, are, they are doing it deliberately for their pocket and not for the people, then he's the one who doesn't know what he's saying. Or is denying. Because we have to yeah, exactly. That is, self, that is self-denier. You know what I mean, sir? Because there are people who are doing all of this intentionally. They are. They know what they are doing. Okay? Def so definitely. If, if somebody who is seeing all of this says it's not true, I call them dangerous people, sir. D more than dangerous. So anybody who is uh, befriending them, associating with them, Made, More than dangerous. Them, Mayugun, the, huh? the man who is talking to you, I am 66 years to be 67 in I April. I am lucky with the elderly. And some people are wondering why I speak like I have wisdom. How could I have all of you around? No, 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 the, 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 no. Wisdom, Mayugun, wisdom is not about age, just like you, you say. I mean, I'm surrounded by people of wisdom. Yes. So therefore, somehow, somehow, eh? It will always sort of uh, affect somehow. You don't think so, sir? Thank you. That is the truth because I normally I normally enjoy where you say that even the old grow. I mean, even the foolish grow old. Because it's true, sir. Oh, which is which I is wrong. the truth? <laughs> no, not all. Which is the truth? Because if somebody so, who is foolish when he's younger, they say, "Oh, he will don't still, uh, of course, he will, he will still, he will still remain foolish." Uh -huh. Then my forty, or turn fifty, even seventy, yes. and you come yes. here and you can say. Ah, why did that man sound like that? Like somebody who is just, ah, shut up, it's Abel Agbas. And so, she foolish people know they grow old, didn't it? Eh? Do we pray yeah. for foolish people to die young? <laughs> no, not, not even if you pray for them. Like, like, you, like you say, wishes are not what is going to happen. We Nigerians, we are all Nigerians, wherever we go. Just like you say, that it is Nigeria will happen so to you yeah. wherever you are. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Wherever you are. Mm -hmm. I have been out of Nigeria since 1998. I have visited until very recently, just last year. I, I was, in fact, I'm a retired person. I just said, okay, this country belongs to us, I have to go. Hmm. I have been there, I have seen things for myself, and I came back. But the truth is that Nigerians, both home and away, must take it up and say, this is not about Mayegun. This is not about pre the president. This is not about one person. It's about everyone who wants to get free from this contraction it's we call Nigeria. Arrangement. It's not in our interest. It's not it, in your interest. It it's not, not in my interest. And if nothing is done, these people will make us perish. They and are already people. making, we are already my ego, by now, I should I am still sitting down here in London mm. because when I went home, the idea I took home, mm. I, I saw that even my wife was laughing at me when I was going that what you are going to that's why I said it's my country, I will go. When I came back, he's <laughs> telling me when I am a patriotic DC. If they cannot send me away from my country, we yeah, must I cannot, be, uh, but, and when you got but there, since, I'll, since I'll, I come back, she's uh -huh. asking me now, when are you going back? I say I'm thinking about it. <laughs> Because you have to, and there is something there, sir, right, that we yes. must continue to remind our people. Usually people will say, oh, well, you have escaped, Jare, you should be thanking your God. Now we that, all of us that are here, we are the ones that, but what you don't know is that, sir, you left in yes. 1998. I bet 
I do not really have to know why you left, okay? But you did leave, right? But there's something what? I can bet. Yes. You had a plan as well that whatever you are pursuing or whatever was the reason why you are leaving Nigeria in 1998, once you kind of finished them, uh, and I am going, going back, back, home. back home. But do they know now that people like yourself at your age, eh, yes, you would yes. have uh, completed your country home, possibly set up a small business or even big business that you can easily say, I am now shuttling between London and Nigeria because I am going to be returning there in five yes. years or in three years. Now, people who used to plan like that, sir, they are now, yes. uh, Baba. They are now adding years to their days they will return home. My, my God, God, God has given God, God has given you a mandate, and, that and no one can, and no one will take it from you. Amen. No one, no one, because all the prayers of those who can speak, who has got it's my first I'm a first time caller, anyhow. Just like I told you, I never want to call because I just believe it's not going to be possible. But we are just in bed. My wife challenged me. Why not try? If you don't try, you won't go through. Exactly. You know, that's what in this place now. If you don't ask, you don't get. If you don't ask, you won't get. There's no Is it true? Asking. If you don't yes. ask, you don't get. My you don't listen to us. I'll, I'll say it for the opt-in time. I yes. will. I will. I will. I will continue to do. And I yes. promise I'm going to be trying to write from now. <laughs> every, the every day. can be shared sometimes. You know what? We men, sir, right? Sometimes we are like that boss, okay? The reason yes. why it's good to listen to her is this. If anything goes wrong, right, you can share the blame. She will take off, you take off. And every, <laughs> each of you can walk around later and say, you know, it won't be like, uh, you know, uh, I told you, say, uh, you told me I didn't listen. But anyway, sir, go on. My, listen, the truth is, what is happening right now is no longer even the blind with, without eyes can see yes, what is happening. Even the deaf can hear whatever is going on right now in Nigeria. If any human being that has a brain, even when he doesn't want to use it, can see that this is the end of it. But it must not be, uh, okay, yes, I want to do something. Let them, let them. You have us, look, there's nothing that anybody wants to want to hear that you have not said mm. Mm. so what i will say us is now to learn how to is it, it, we need to push yes. just like you said yes. like i tell you like i can tell you my nick, nickname is my because yes. any opportunity i have yes. any opportunity i have mm -hmm. joking on the phone every i will preach it i will yes. just say okay you don't i don't know how to put it right but let me just give you the link and try and listen listen to him you will find out what i'm talking about some will tell you uh, uh it's from Yoruba. i said that is your problem you have not listened you are already making thing, the conclusion the old video i sent to you don't worry i'll send you another one so <laughs> when you send him another one and they say oh he's uh he's uh this or that i say okay is that i am not even, I, I don't even send video i send the link you get go and listen to this man first before be, you sir. then you can convince me convince me later that is wrong yes and everyone that has got back to me has said, thank you. Hmm. So in respect of that, I am thanking you on behalf of all well-meaning Nigerians, obedience you. and everything. And I assure you, not by my power, but the special grace of God, that nothing will stop you. Amen. And everybody will join. Amen. And that country, just like you said, I am not a believer of Nigeria. Hmm. I am not we a believer of Nigeria in, because we all have something that, in common. That's what I say. Yeah, we, we do, we do, yes, we do. For God. So I am not a believer in Mayegun. Anybody that feels comfortable around Mayegun means you have something that you, you disagree with. I am That's not a Nigeria. believer of Nigeria because and, uh, Nigeria is not a nation. It's not for the people. So there's no point deceiving ourselves, hoping on hope, when you have proven for the past sixty years or more that it's not working and it will never work. Then you stick up to, oh, well, let us try. And why are you trying what you have proved, proved that is not working? Sir, you are older than Nigeria by your age, right? Yes. Which means that uh, how can somebody now say God created Nigeria? No, God did when not create not any Nigeria. Nigeria. No, but no, no, no. God did not create Nigeria. Nigeria. Yeah. The foreigners created Nigeria for, the, for their own purpose. Independent Nigeria, law, exactly. 
So if anyone yeah, would lie to me and say God created Nigeria, I'll no, be no, no, that is absolute stupidity. I can't believe you when you said that. It's, it's blasphemy, no. sir. It's even blasphemy. Uh, yeah. Of course, yeah, you of course. God using the name of God, but, but what you, you know, know is not true. How it came by? What, what you know is not true. It's not. You. Thank you so much. Thank you, my dear. Thank you very much. I will keep on now trying from now on because I know I can get through. Thank on you. On this one, eh? on this one, yes. I pray. I mean, I always, I always wish that. My wife, say, what, this is say a word to, to Maya Gun so that you know I'm not lying. I don't know what to say. I'm a foreigner. I'm not oh, Nigerian. Oh, hello, ma. But I was going to say hi, but. When I know my husband. Yes. Sorry, like, go on. Uh, uh, 1986. Right. When we start in Spain. Hmm. The one when they told me, he said, I can't find my money. I don't call marriage. So it was boy and go, boyfriend and girlfriend. And right. today we are together. Almost See? 40 years coming now. And you are from where originally? I cannot get no way to go back. <laughs> I'm still going. <laughs> encourage everybody, please do something for Nigeria. Thank you, my ego. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you so you much. Okay. And thanks for making him do this as well. All right. You yes. have done something tonight and you've introduced me to one of my best friends. Okay. <laughs> I was going to ask, where are you originally from? But I am from I am an Urobo man from you, Delta State. You are a Urobo man from Delta. God bless you, sir. Okay. And Thank you have you. a wonderful evening. All right. And you too, and my say me well to the missus again. Tell her. I, said, I, 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 will. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. I love when couples are very comfortable to uh some of you don't understand this though. You need to be at home where couples sit together and watch the same program.